morning and thank you for joining our daily outlook. And today we'll cover the changes in the Australian dollar and US dollar pair. Greg will be sharing insights from our trading desk. The Aussie dollar pair gained 0.4% in the last session. The RSI is giving a positive signal. The last session saw Nike shares rise 1.4%. The Williams indicator indicates an overbought market. The dollar-yen pair made a minor downwards correction in the last session, dropping 0.1%. The Williams indicator is giving a positive signal. The last session saw the pound rise 0.4% against the dollar. According to the Stochastic RSI, we are in an overbought market. Moving on to world financial news. The Canadian dollar edged lower against its U.S. counterpart, giving back some of its recent gain as dovish guidance from the European Central Bank helped boost the greenback. India's antitrust regulator has accused Amazon.com Inc. of concealing facts and making false submissions when it sought approval for a 2019 investment in a future group unit. Oil rose to the highest in a week amid expectations that recovering demand for the U.S. to India and Europe will further tighten global crude markets. Thank you. Coming up, our chief analyst review of today's most interesting economic events. The U.K.'s retail sales will be released at 600 GMT, the U.S. market manufacturing PMI at 1345 GMT, the U.S. market services PMI at 1345 GMT. The UK's market services PMI will be released at 8.30 GMT, the French market manufacturing PMI at 7.15 GMT, Japan's CFTC JPY NC net positions at 19.30 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day.